A series of ground reports have been sent in by my colleagues. Let's take a listen. Colonel Rao, we have already seen that your machines are reaching up to the top. How big is the challenge of the logistics and how much time can it take? We have a little interference, which is a vibration and a public moment. If it's empty, we will make a road in 2-3 hours. There are also international experts. Are there any suggestions for them? There is no suggestion for them. 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 What can you say? Will you reach there today? Yes, it will reach there. Because BRO has done a lot of work in your own. तेजी से दिखाई पड़ा है या 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 बिल्कुल मैं पहुंच जाएगा कोई डॉट नहीं सर काफी लंबा वक्त हो गया है अब इन लोगों को जो भी लोग फंसे हुए मजदूर अलग अलग राज्यों से उनके परिवार वाले लोग पहुंच रहे हैं काफी प्रेशर है इस प्रेशर में एनडीआरएफ किस तरीके से जो कोऑर्डिनेटेड वे में काम कर रहे हैं तो एनडीआरए तो इस तरह के जो जो मुझे अभी इसके में लग रहा है कि अगर टनल बनता है और जिसमें एक्सेस अप्रोच बनता है उसमें से एनडीआरएफ के लोग अंदर जा सकते हैं या उनको रोक की जरूरत है कोई सपोर्ट की स्ट्रक्चर की जरूरत है तो लोग जाके अंदर से उनको फिजिकली भी ला सकते हैं अगर कोई चलने में कोई दिक्कत हो रही तो हम स्ट्रक्चर में भी करके बार बार बाड़ी बाड़ी से ला सकते हैं उसके लिए हमारे लोग ट्रेंड है ऑलरेडी हमने प्रैक्टिस और ड्रिल भी किया हुआ है वहाँ पर और उस हिसाब से हम जैसे जैसे ये प्रोग्रेस होते जा रहा है हम अपनी प्लानिंग उस तरह से हम उसको रिव्यू करके ताकि अगर जब भी एक्सेस मिलता है तो हम इस पर काम करना शुरू करें तो भारत की एजेंसियां तो हैं ही विदेशी लोग एक्सपर्ट्स भी यहाँ पर इन्वॉल्व हो रहे हैं तो किस तरीके से प्रोसेस चलेगा जिससे कि सभी जिंदगियों को बचाया जा सके तो जो भी एक्सपर्ट है अगर केंद्र सरकार राज्य सरकार या एजेंसी को लगता है कि वो वो मदद कर सकते हैं उनका एक्सपीरियंस काम आ सकता है तो सब तो वो वो प्रिंट करके उनसे भी ओपिनियन और एडवाइस लेना है ताकि बेस्ट जो ऑप्शन है क्योंकि सेफ्टी बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है जो आप बोल रहे थे कि टाइम क्यों लगता है क्योंकि सेफली निकालना ज़्यादा इम्पोर्टेंट है इसलिए भी एक्सपर्ट का एडवाइस और ओपिनियन लिया जा रहा ताकि जो भी काम करे वो सक्सेसफुल कर सके एट वन पॉइंट यू विल ऑल्सो सी द जियो फिजिकल टीम दैट हैज बिन रोप इन टू मॉनिटर द activities just over the this surface uh, in the tunnel that as it is believed that the structure is so fragile now here the team of uh, geophysical survey has reached here with their equipments and now they'll be setting up a structure here and this will analyze the structure of uh, you know uh, this the debris also and from this surface to inside the tunnel as there is a massive uh, you know uh, rock and obstruction which is blocking the horizontal penetration this will help the agencies to check out and design further plan and plan of action. Ashutosh is in fact joining us live for the very latest on the ground. Ashutosh, give us a sense of what's really happening. You in fact a while ago had a word with Professor Arnold and he's told you that the terrain is a big challenge. When can we really expect some breakthrough? At the end of the day, it's been over eight days now. Well, unfortunately, none of these agencies are able to tell us uh, that what will be the time frame by when the rescue operation could be completed. Because as we speak, uh, at this moment, uh, the process to start the rescue operation is underway. We cannot say it's actually the rescue operation because uh, the American uh, machine hasn't started working yet in the last 24 hours because now there is a safety concern for those workers already working inside for the horizontal drilling process we're using the American auger machine. Subsequently, uh, Professor uh, Dix is here. I spoke to him and, and he said because of the difficulties in the terrain and the, which is the very fragile nature of uh, the Himalayan mountain in this part of country in Uttarakhand. So that makes really challenging. Every moment there's a vibration of uh, the machines were rolling out inside that creates more and more uh, debris falling inside. So that makes really very crucial. The robotics are being used to sense the data. The geological teams are assessing the depth, debris and also the structure, the exactly uh, vertically uh, measuring the tunnel, what could be possibly inside. Subsequently, as far as vertical drill is concerned, this cannot be started in next 24 hours as matter of challenges to reaching the terrain. The BRO is really uh, putting all its best work and very uh, with all its effort they are uh, narrow, uh, you know widening the road reaching out to exactly the point where the flag has been made where exactly the drilling will start so until unless this process of starting the rescue operation is complete
completed, it will take quite time. So it may take another 24 to 48 hours to restart the operations once the safety process. And let me tell you the fastest way, even the professor says, uh, could be the horizontal drilling. But for now, you have to ensure the safety of uh, the current workers and the ongoing operations. And then only the process could start. So the, another challenge was to ensure food and logistics. For that, another uh, you know six inches diameter of pipe is being inserted. So this makes really a difficult operation in the mountains in Himalaya, in Uttarakhand.